everybody, this is your girl Moosley, joined by Dash, DJ Speeds, to Shane, and the one and only Jay Something. Girl. And just in case you didn't know, it is Vuzu M's second birthday. We've been making a whole lot of noise about it. Mm -hmm. And since it is a birthday, and I'm the recipe queen, <laughs> I thought we should make a cake. With mayo on it. <laughs> With mayo on it. Let's not take it that far. Let's not take it that far. Jay, you're going to help us? Yes. We need you because none of us know how to bake. No, this is, this is really simple. So if you guys at home and you want to learn how to make a cake, this is your chance. It's really, really easy. All right, so the first thing that we're going to do is crack some eggs and separate the eggs, yeah. all right? So we've got egg yolks here, we've got egg whites here. That's a serious skill. Oh, so it's easy. Take an egg, crack it into your hand. Do you hand. do it with your voice? Like, do you just... <laughs> <laughs> and then uh, what we've got is uh, caster sugar. So we're going to make, mix caster sugar with the eggs. So let's do that okay. straight away. And I'm just going to pass down. Cool. So Jay, you've obviously done something like this before. I mean... I do like a lot of cooking. Like, I like cooking, but I'm not like a big baking fan because it's quite Shoot. like... Normally, it's quite meticulous. When do I do this until? Uh, until it starts to get creamy. It starts to blend together, yeah? Okay. All right, it's yeah. looking good. Look good. good work, Spista! Well done, bro. After that, which is like nearly done, I'm going to swing that. That's all the dry, dry ingredients. That's flour, cocoa powder, that's baking powder, and a little pinch of salt. So you can stop it there, sweet stuff. How do I stop? At the top, push back. Hey, push back. <laughs> just how we do it. There's, there's, a, there's a technique to it. You don't just like, just throw it in. You just like. But where do you even get the time to cook yeah. in your busy schedule? Because every Monday. Every so Monday? I, three years ago, I told my manager that I wanted every Monday off. I never wanted to do anything on a Monday. And then I just cook. It's quite therapeutic. Like, I think it's quite fun, you know? Do you cook for fun or do you cook? I cook for fun. I cook for fun. Now it's turned into like a thing that I do like yeah. in front of people. Let's talk about how that diversified your brand though, yeah. like your love for cooking. You know, I, I don't do cook, I never did cooking so that I could like create another brand to make money off. Now I'm working on a cookbook, I've had two TV shows, it's, it's pretty bizarre, like pretty much the same as music, like I had the dream of doing music. And then I met Duda and Mo randomly at a party, and now we travel the world, which is amazing. Let's talk about traditional oh, stuff, like traditional cooking, man, like yes. those meals, because you're Portuguese. Have you ever tried doing like Zulu meals? I grew up in the Eastern Cape, so things like mmusho is something that I know how to make. I recently was at Delicious I love Fest. that you know how to say it too. Yeah. What I need you to do now, which is probably the most important part of sure. this, take the egg whites, and you can just do this bit by bit, like there's no need to rush. You can chuck that in, and then we literally just need to fold it in. All right, and this just, this just takes time. So it's just that circular motion because we don't want to get the air out of the eggs. So that will, we'll put that into that tray, which we've uh, put some uh, parching paper as well, as well as some... Forgive no more, this is just used to our dumbbell. Just... No, but no more, it's not looking like how Jay is looking. No Muzi, I told you, chill, bro. <laughs> Yo, 